What's up YouTube, LND here. Uh, today we're going to be playing some more Don't Starve. Um, I haven't done fucking anything since the last video I recorded of this, which was like, I don't know, maybe a month or two ago at this point. Um, I kind of fell out of touch with the games, both DST and the normal Don't Starve. So, uh, I guess I don't... I don't know. They weren't fun to me anymore, so I stopped playing, but I want to uh, continue this for at least a couple more videos. I don't know how long I'm going to go. I don't think I'm actually going to find uh, Maxwell's door uh, before I die anyway, but I also don't want to have a fucking... I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Anyway, I got nothing done, so everything's still the fucking same. Okay, we're all set. We got damage, probably by, um, whatchamacallum, hounds. So, I guess m this main part of it, maybe I'll go a little bit longer than I normally do, but I'll do a little bit more editing from shit. think what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to attempt to get to the brick road, if I don't already have it somewhere. And we're just gonna follow it one way until it leads me to somewhere. I believe Maxwell Door is supposed to be on on the um, on the brick road somewhere. Okay, the brick road is actually right there, right where I have my stuff. So we're gonna follow it downwards. No, nope, we're not, because that doesn't go anywhere. Fuck me. Okay, I haven't been up here. Or up here. Holy fucking hell. Okay, that's not even the brick road. Okay, I need to get to here. Is there a wormhole close to where I am? There's a wormhole, like, right fucking next to me, actually. Toronto! I use that shit. Alright, I'm gonna lose, like, all my sanity. Actually, that wasn't that bad. Alright, cool, and I got food that will easily keep me full. Not that I don't have 30 ravioli or whatever they call it, ratatouille. Alright, that took me very close to the road. <clears throat> what? Gobbler, where's he at? I could probably take him out. There he is. Attack! Peep. Get him! Alright, what's this? No way! I- holy sh- I actually just found Maxwell's door! You're about to step into a long, arduous journey to find Maxwell. You will- You will need to survive five worlds, each randomly generated to present a new challenge. You should- should you die? You will start back at this portal, but lose all your progress on the journey. Not yet. Holy shit, you know what? I'm sorry guys, I know a lot of people don't actually like- like this stuff, but I have to screen the f three minutes into the video, and I found Maxwell's door. All right, so you start at the portal every time you die. Fucking YOLO, guys. There is no way that that just happened. That's about the coolest fucking shit that's ever happened to me. That'd be like. Me starting up a Pokemon game and being like, Okay guys, we're going to attempt to find a shiny legendary Dratini, but uh, it's probably not going to happen. And then like, immediately finding one. Yes, that's fucking right. A Pokemon references, bitch. Bitch. I'm thirsty. I had a bunch of chicken strips. Chapter 1 of 5, The King of Winter. Oh, you found my portal, did you? You think it would have learned your lesson by now? Hmm, let's try something a little more challenging, shall we? The divining rod holder. Can I take this? Alright. Okay. I don't have anything on me. I like the winter stuff. There's some stuff over here. There's a fucking blueprint. Okay. okay. Ooh, a fucking egg. Sweet. Chop this down, we'll get some charcoal. Now, 
I was playing with a friend the other day, or not the other day, a while ago. We we're playing DST, or Don't Starve Together for use for, I guess, if you don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. How do I make a torch or something for fire? Grass. I right, build a fire. Oh, it's so... Oh, I, I just... The coziness. It's actually beginning warmer around where I live, too. So, uh... Oh, I like the birds. Damn it. I was actually hoping that it would just say what they were. Um, cold in, colder where I live. So, like, it's just been cozy being inside. That feeling you get. Hopefully I don't get attacked. Okay. Oh, uh, attacked right away. Okay, let's throw some fuel on that. And the main thing with this stuff is unless you go and find, like, immediately find stuff to keep you warm, it's very hard not to freeze to death in this game. Or at least in the winter stuff. Now, even with mods, I'm going to have a very hard time. Actually, I believe Haley gets um, colder faster. I don't, there, and that's the thing, too. There's no, like, warmth meter or anything. And I don't know if this is the same map or if it's different. No, uh, it's different. Alright, there's some berries over here. Alright, anyway, the story about the DST... Um, which is Don't Starve Together, I don't know if I mentioned that. Probably sound like an asshole. Um, uh, nice jump, Garfield, but I- no, nope, I can't let you out right now. I don't got the time to get up. Um. Alright. Be right back, guys. Alright, sorry about- Okay. Should be apologizing for my nose feeling so fucking itchy like I just ran a 40 lines of crack. Um. Whoops, sorry about that. Smack the microphone. Um. DST, friend, playing. Got attacked by one of those deer clops. Biggest load of bullshit that there ever did was in the game. Rabbit. Oh, oh, okay, I see what that did. They gave me the option to immediately make the hat. So I can grab some sticks and whatnot and make it with the, the traps to catch the rabbits. So I can make it. Okay, we got pine cones we'll use for fuel. Just used all my grass. Alright, now I am trying to find rabbit holes. Actually, I didn't see a rabbit over here. I don't know if there actually are rabbit holes or what. Also, we got attacked by penguins in it. Not like actually attacked by them, but there are a ton of motherfucking penguins. I think this one trap will do us good. I need uh, grass. What do these turn into? The spiky bushes. What do you get out of them? Right. Okay. Berry bushes. Because I'm getting hungry. More berry bushes. Alright, so... So pretty much... This or the next couple videos will probably be the last I'll do on Don't Starve. At least for now. Unless I get really back into it. Because... I, my main goal was to find Maxwell's door in this episode, kind of have an excuse to move on for something for now, or move on to something else for now. I wasn't expecting to immediately find it like that. Like, everything I looked at it was like, oh, it's a complete, complete luck thing, you'll never find it, give up on your life, just go kill yourself now. Um, but, I don't know, I guess I got really lucky. Not only if I could gamble at the fucking poker tables and be that lucky. I might have to build another fire and waste of- okay, whatever. I have to build another fire, I can't fuck around. Alright, this is a good spot too, because there's plenty of stuff here. There's actually a, uh, rabbit hole right there. Can I build one? I can. 
Might as well set it up there. Boop. Alright. If I can... Actually, let's cut this down. If I can, uh... Get to the point where I can find some stones, I'll be able to set up a camp. Like, it's... I don't know if it's really worth... Uh, can I eat this? Oh, that's a fucking thermal stone, damn it. That... A warm and cuddly rock. I believe... Let's examine. Let me get rid of this. Can I equip this? I don't know what this does exactly. I don't I don't remember quite what's this. Telecatter staff blueprint. Well, I better learn that too. Can I build that then? Is that what you're trying to tell me? I need some living wood. Alright, I need to cook some berries and eat some stuff or I will starve to death. I know, I'm so sad to see that Haley say she's hungry like that. Alright. Alright, night is coming. I don't know if the deer clops is in this game, in the one I'm playing. I don't quite remember if I chose to do Reign of Giants or not. I kind of hope I didn't, because it honestly, to me, it doesn't add nothing to the game. Of value, at least. Alright, I'm gonna munch on some more french fries. <laughs> no, no. This fucking game is so chill and laid back. Alright, let me build this, my last two sticks. I wish I wish I knew how to get those. I don't know if there's a different item for them or not. Thinking um the shipwreck DLC to get Spiky Bush, I think you attack it with a hatchet or whatever they're called, a machete. But those aren't in this game, are they? Let me drop this and see if it does anything. Huh. I don't know if that's supposed to do something for me. Alright, day and night. Night is about over. So I just said you had to survive four worlds. I wonder if uh, you have to survive something specific. Or if you have to, like, find another door or something. I'll have to look that up. Of course it starts you off in winter. Fucking bastards. This is, like, the worst scenario. Like, winter is always the least survivable, like, condition, weather condition there is. Mainly because you fucking freeze to death right away. I need to go out and find, uh, somewhere to get some rocks. Alright, there's a frozen pond right there. Wait, did she just slip? No, okay, I thought she slid across it. Which would have been awesome. I need to get catch some of those rabbits is what I need to do so I can get, uh... Where's the other trap at? I might grab that. Okay. Let's see if there's a rabbit around here. Nah, it doesn't look like it. Um... Because if I can get the earmuffs, I'll stay warmer. And I don't know if I lose sanity as bad during the winter. Probably doesn't... Winter, the weather probably doesn't affect it at all. I thought there would be rabbits coming out of those holes. Maybe... Hopefully I'll be... Well, I can... Okay, I kind of forgot that I'd be able to see that stuff on the map anyway. Alright, just trying to collect all the good shit that I can while I'm out. Flowers will be a good source for sanity. Because you can eat them to replenish your sanity also, I believe. Let me just check that real quick. Uh, health is what it actually replenishes. Alright, that's good. So, that is... So the berry bushes seem like they're going to be a big thing for me. Okay, now if I just fucking had a trap... Where's your hole? It's right there. Alright, I think I can do this right. If I go and grab one of these traps up here. Or I'm freezing to death. I need, think I need to build a torch. Actually, I know I need to build a torch. Which I can't because I don't have any fucking sticks. Oh shit, I got a rabbit. Get that shit. Pick that shit up. 
Alright, where's my fire? My fire probably burnt out. That's gonna be something too. You're gonna have to probably build... Let me see if this works. If I take this and drop this on the ground... Oh, it probably has to be by a fire. Okay, there's somebody, like, freaking out outside my house right now. Alright. Alright, where the fuck is it? Will you shut the fuck up? Jesus Christ. Hey! Quiet the fuck down out there, you little bitch! Get him! Get him! No. Get him in the trap. Do it! Alright. Put that trap on the thing. Come on, come out. Alright. I'm not getting hurt from the... Oh, you fucking bitch. Alright, alright, fire. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm putting putting it down. I mean the fucking thing. Alright. Let me put this down. Could heat it up near a fire. Okay, so yeah. So leaving it by a fire... Will make the stone hot, right? And then... Okay, I need two rabbits and a stick. Thermal stone. So I'll just leave that out for a while. And it'll get warm and I can take it with me other places. Cut down some more trees. Think maybe... Okay... Oh shit, my thing just broke. Okay, give me this before it becomes like impossible to carry with me. Alright. Oh, well, okay, I can't build an axe. Alright. Where's my pickaxe? Equip this shit. I need... Is it working also as like a light source? Do I have enough for another fire if I need it? I do. Alright, that's perfect. Grab as much grass as I can. Because I'm going to need it for... Traps for rabbits and... Shit like that. Fire is another thing I need it for. Alright. Probably... Probably about to the point where I can stop worrying about this shit. Because I need to find sticks. Alright, the stone is going down now. No, it's not. It's, it's not as bright as it was before. I can also eat some of this, these berries. Probably should really cook that stuff. This does so much more when it's cooked for me. <clears throat> oh, da, da. oh, you know what? I completely forgot to tell this story in a different video. It'll probably be up before this one, so I'll tell it now. Um, a while back, uh, me and Advanced Darkness was chilling at the fucking local Walmart. That's not really a local Walmart. Um. But shit you not, there was this old person, like, she was fucking drunk or high or something. She was in the store or whatever, using a self-checkout. And I didn't, I didn't personally see it, because I wasn't fucking, I was too stupid to notice what anybody was pointing out. But this bitch fucking straight up had her nipple hanging out of her shirt. Her fucking nipple. Like, the whole thing. And, like... Thank Jesus I didn't see it. Because I probably would have pu- Penguins! 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 That's awesome. Alright. Well, I got my thermal stone back up a bit. It, it, well, I guess it didn't go down very much. But now I should be able to set up like a actual base fire. So I can, uh, I don't know, have a base, I guess? Those people are still fucking going crazy outside my house. Ugh. What attacks me during the winter? Special hounds? <laughs> fucking drunk ass. Alright, let's actually build that fire. You fucking, Jesus Christ, those people are going bonkers out there. I can still hear those penguins, by the way. I fucking love me some penguins. Alright, I should build an axe. Alright, I got that taken care of. Alright, it's like a kill- Oh, they're fucking adorable! That's fucking adorable. That is- This is so the fucking thumbnail. 
Actually, I am about at 20 minutes, so I think now is probably a good time to end the video. So that's it for this episode of Don't Starve. If you liked it, hit that like button below, leave a comment, and as always, I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Thanks for watching the video. If you'd like to be notified when my new content is released, click the subscribe button on the right. If you're looking for something scary, take a look at my video on Vanish or SCP-087B. These are two of the best horror games I've ever played, and I think you'd agree.